Good morning, Clay Thompson here at Bish's RV in Junction City, Oregon. Today we're going to show you a new 2022 DRV Mobile Suites. This is the 39 DBRS3. Um, it is a full bath forward, half downstairs. So the bath and a half model. Come on inside, let me show you the beautiful coach. This is going to have the full four step fold down more ride solid step makes it very easy to enter does have the keyless entry nice solid screen door with the removable all season uh, covers so if we want the breeze to blow in with the screen door open this has got kind of a light and dark together which really makes it pop out when you turn the lights on or when the sunlight's in it's very very bright um, most people would think with dark wood i'm going to be walking into a dark hole but as you can see this is very bright inside with the elegance of dark wood but yet being nice and bright inside dinette area here on the slide out on the door side uh, table pulls out there is an extra leaf Two more folding chairs so we can fit four people at the dinette table. Along with our solid surface top here, drawers down below and underneath the cabinet area that are full functionable with 110 outlets on both sides and USB on the side here. Wood balances, bank of overhead cabinets with the piston hinges so they stay open. Um, Dual pane insulated windows. We pan on down to the theater seating, looking directly at the TV, just about eight feet away instead of being much further away from your TV. So it makes sitting there watching TV much more comfortable to most people. Um, dinette areas, living area here with the couch, hide a bed, windows, dual roller shades. So you have the day shade and the dark out day shade so we can look out still see out can't see in or with the shade all the way up full bank of cabinets across the back end as well tons of storage throughout this coach um, we could put shelving in there or this could be a nice area for tall things um, the entertainment area here with our tv this does have a swing out bracket for the tele television to be able to watch from over that direction if need be as well as having storage in behind storage above in the cabinets storage below you have the fireplace the sound bar here fireplace cabinetry on both sides and a pull out drawer or this could utilize could be made into a desk as well very very nice nice big island in this model are all the mobile suites products are going to be standard with a great big dishwasher this is probably the biggest dishwasher that you're going to find in an rv works very well and if you don't use a dishwasher i hear they make great bread baskets uh, cabinets throughout with all the new pull out shelves and then this one has the plug-in in the back end there if we want to utilize it for our appliance garage. Cabinets above. Nice solid surface countertops and backsplash. Big four burner cooktop with the great big insignia oven. Big pots and pan cabinets and drawers. And in the island with cabinets and drawers as well. Under sink, we do have our sink top cover stored way down below. Easy access. Nice big sink. Nice faucet. Then we have a hidden out of sight garbage can in the drawer. Nice big residential refrigerator. bigger than some people may have at home with the freezer. This is gonna have a built-in filter 
as well as the full house being filtered. So we're twice filtered for our water dispenser and ice maker down below. Does come with the travel lock, overhead storage, storage there, storage there. They just didn't waste any space. Nice big island for food prep as well. We come around and we have the half bath. This is going to have a cabinet here to be able to open and have our stackable two-piece washer and dryer if. Or we can put more shelves in there and just make it a great big pantry. We've got the vanity uh, cabinets above and below the sink with the nice mirror and a window above and the nice uh, adjustable fan above in the ceiling. As we start up the stairway, we do have our component system here that our docking station that we can turn things on off, open awnings, turn on our heat uh, pads for our holding tanks if need be. We have our remote for our fan in the kitchen. It stores away there and uh, the, the, the important sp stuff right here. So all of your controls are all in one easy place. And then we have an above closet area to take off our coat, hang it up. Nice big pocket door here into the bedroom. With the built-in lock. Nice big king bed. Flat flush floor throughout all the way around the bed. So no, no step up around the bed. We have individual windows, we have individual lighting, we got a full bank of cabinets above the bed, and then we have our dimmer switches for our individual reading lights, 110 plug-ins on the rear side with USB, and then we got 110 plug-ins on the front side uh, there, as well as having a little shelf and table on each side of the bed. We also have the vanity here. Now that has the slide out here that's only about an eight inch slide, but it does give us eight drawers. Um, a place here for a little uh, DVD player. Our TV here that's going to play music and TV all through one entertainment center. Uh, backlit lighting. Fan here for our fan that's going to have adjustable speed, intake, and exhaust. And then when we come into the master bathroom, this is really big. Porcelain toilet. Now these are macerator toilets, so they're going to grind everything to a liquid form before it ever hits the tank so it makes the plumbing access and discharge super easy because it's going to be all turned to liquid before it even exits the tank nice big one piece glass shower enclosure got a seat area there we got a skylight with shade we got light we got a power fan in the bathroom as well with our control above the sink this is going to have the dual sink system. Now, one thing to remember, obviously, this is in stock. Uh, one thing with DRV is that they do can do some custom changes. Some people prefer to have one sink in here. I can make that happen for you. There are some other changes that I can make happen. We can talk about that later. Or in a phone call, when I drop you my uh, phone number, we can talk about some of the changes if somebody wanted to do some changes. It is probably the only luxury fifth wheel out there that is doing customizations um, and still get your unit completed in a timely manner. Um, more cabinets throughout in the bathroom with adjustable shelving on the top and fixed shelving down below. Very, very deep. Closet here opens up. Cedar lined, uh, removable hang hanger rods. This is going to have the built-in safe inside the closet. Little shoe rack above. Your two folding chairs for the dinette can store in here or underneath the bed or in the basement, but right now they're in the closet. Four more drawers. A uh, little vanity on top there. And then more storage as we wrap around into the bathroom with adjustable shelving in top and bottom on this side. So... As you can see, this whole trailer, not just the bathroom, not just the bedroom, 
you're going to have tons of storage throughout the whole trailer. So it is a full timer's dream. It's going to be your home on wheels. Come on outside. Let me show you the outside. This fifth wheel is going to have four slide outs. So we have the vanity slide. We have the big basement down below. We have motion sensor lights. Easy access to our plumbing and furnace system, as well as holding tanks. And then more access on the other side. When you look at these baggage doors, going to be thicker than most everybody else, as well as the walls on the mobile suites are going to be three and a quarter inch thick walls. So uh, thicker than just about anybody else out there in the industry as well. This is going to be a dual axle system with uh, disc brakes and the more right independent suspension. Two patio awnings, dual pane insulated windows. This is what they call their half body paint, but it looks very, very nice. If we want something with paint to go along the sides of the slide sides, we can do that too. We can do fiberglass roof. We can do quartz countertops. There's a lot of things that this product and manufacturer can do uh, to make it your home that's to your liking. So bear that in mind. One piece end cap out the back end, receiver hitch, ladder to access the roof, power cord reel. That's, uh, you know, a 50 amp cord in 40 degree temperature is like wrestling an alligator. This is gonna just be push button. If it's time to go, it is cold weather. We just push the button, let it wrap itself up and away we go. Real nice feature. This is gonna be the access to if we're gonna winterize or just to access the back side of the refrigerator. Little storage compartment here. The Truma AquaGo tankless water heater, really nice feature, standard on all the mobile suites. This is gonna have our, um, what I would call the docking station. So our water plug-ins, our tank flush, and uh, gate valves, as well as 110 electricity inside with a light. Off door side, passage access. Again, gotta show the famous copper manifold system, the full house filtration system, and how the heat ducts blow right on the water manifold so we don't have freezing water or frozen water when we uh, get up in the morning on those cold mornings. Two big 40 pound propane tanks on a slide out tray. You know, and remember the mobile suites is built on a triple stack box tube frame. So we got a lower two by three, two by six on top, and another two by six on top of that, which makes a two by 15, three piece box tube frame rails, as well as when we stand back and look at our jacks, they're at an angle. So it makes the uh, support ability way sturdier than anything that's gonna be straight up and down. be our compartment here for our batteries again on a pull-out tray battery disconnect inverter and our hydraulic system and then this unit is prepped for a generator so we already have the firebox going to have the relays uh, re um, the uh, transfer box already built in for the generator when we install it the more ride pin box two-piece molded fifth wheel cap. So we have our one-piece end cap out front, and then this being a molded cap here with the rut guard protection and painted over. So really outfits this coach. Uh, looks very, very beautiful um, and a great floor plan. It is one of their top floor plans being the bath and a half model. And so if you have any questions on the DRV Mobile Suites product, whether it be the full house or the mobile suites, Feel free to contact me direct at 541-979-1770. Again, that's Clay Thompson with Bish's RV here in Junction City, Oregon. Look at this beautiful day.